I am Dr. Colleen Conklin, the Executive Director of the Gates Aerospace Institute. We provide high school students dual enrollment opportunities, which are courses and classes exactly as what are offered here on campus, preparing students for future careers in STEM and aviation. Exposure to programs like this, specifically for young women, are critical because you need to see it to believe that you actually could do it. We have very low numbers as far as females in aviation right now. In the industry, it's kind of flatlined throughout our history, actually. So you need diversity in all aspects of aviation because it will help your organization grow. And for the future of all of us, I think that innovation would require more diversity. My name is Fabiola Gordo Acevedo. I'm from Eustis High School and I'm part of the Gates Aerospace Institute. Through Gates Aerospace, I was able to earn the scholarship opportunity. I'm going to earn my private pilot's license during the summer. I've always wanted to go to college, but after taking these dual enrollment courses, it's opened me up to more opportunities. I did not think I was going to get that scholarship. I never even thought that I was going to be going to college. I'm Amber Ann Marie Cole. I am in the Human Factors program here at Embry-Riddle and currently I am part of the Accelerated Master's program here. You could say that the Gates Institute really propelled me forward with uh, career aspirations, college aspirations. The Institute didn't just allow you to get your feet wet in um, flight or piloting or the ground school, but they had everything. As a young woman, being you know a high school student, I knew women could be pilots, but it just seemed so, so far out of reach. And it wasn't until Gates Institute that it really clicked that this is something that I can, I can make a career out of doing, something that I love. The young women that were there, we formed lifelong friendships. We still talk today, actually. My, my best friend was from that class, and my other best friend was my flight instructor, and she was actually the professor for that class as well having my flight instructor and friend in that role of like a mentor student type relationship that was a huge push and motivator forward having my horizons push really opened my eyes to a world of possibility my name is Jade King I'm a research psychologist here at the Air Force Research Lab at the Wright Patterson Air Force Base Growing up, I've always wanted to be an astronaut, and so I already loved aviation and aerospace, but after entering the Gates Institute, they kind of gave me a roadmap as to how to get there. Right now, I'm a research psychologist, and primarily I work with human autonomous agent teaming. So really, that means that um, I'm measuring human performance and how autonomous agent teams affect human performance, and I'm looking at that in multiple contexts, including rocket cargo and some space contexts, and also mission planning and aircraft combat contexts as well. I definitely think that Embrutal prepared me uh, for success in my career. I learned everything I know about aviation through Embrutal. Um, I learned everything I know about human factors through Embrutal, um, from the classwork to being able to see how the principles I learned in class actually affect real world circumstances, to conferences and job fairs, and just getting to connect with young people who have similar interests to me. Like I think. It definitely made a difference, really prepared me uh, for where I am today. And out in the field, it's always great to run into other ERU alumni and see them doing well. So you still have that community even after you graduate. I think it's super important for young girls to see women in aviation in these STEM fields excelling and thriving because it shows them that it's possible. I would definitely credit my time at Embry-Riddle and the Gates Institute 100% for where I am today.